So, hello there this morning. This is Jewel, your Instapot girl. So this morning I'm going to be showing you about the KitchenAid attachments that you can uh, use on your KitchenAid mixer. I've had this for about a year, never used it, so this is a good chance to demonstrate it. So we have three accessories for grading. You can grade cucumbers, cabbage, carrots. We're just doing carrots today. And we're not going to use this one because I don't have anything large enough to grade on this one. So we'll set that to the side. You have these two pieces. You have this right here that goes in there. You have a piece on this side. This little clip right here, that little piece right there fits into this. So what you do is just put it in there so like that. And this screw right here tighten, tightens it in. Tighten that in. So that's in there, okay? That's in there. That won't come out. Then you have to put one of these in here. You have a handle on, you have a, a clip on both sides. This handle on both sides. Once it's in there, it's tight. And then you can click it and it'll come out. But I'll show you that. So without further ado, I'm going to do this one first. So we're going to put this one in here. And it just fit. Just push it onto your clip. And that's in. It. it will not come out unless I hit this button. So we're going to grate some carrots. And you can actually use. Just do this without doing that, but we're just gonna do it the right way from the beginning. So, got that groove, and then we got another thing to push, go in the shoot and push that down. Cause see, this is too low, I can't be dealing with that. I'm gonna have to use the big one when I get ready to really, um, great. yeah, you know what? Let's do this right here, this is what we're gonna do. Let me get a small one. This is already getting on my nerve. So I'm gonna show you how to do a small one first. Well, let me get my big pan because carrots will be everywhere. I went the same as about all these carrots like somebody crazy. But I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with them after we get them grazed up. And that's another video. So my mix is plugged in and I'm going to turn it up so it's going to be loud. So you can just watch and see what I'm doing, okay? And that's all there is to it. Grading up your carrots, that's a lot faster. So, let me see if I can get this one carrot out. I'm going to do it without the, um, doing this mostly because this little shoot, this little thing, it, you can't put a lot in there because like this one, these carrots are so big, that don't fit. So you can always go back and do this and just hold your little, it's going to go down. Don't put your hands in it. Don't put your hands in it. tool to have it really really is so this little piece right here I'm gonna push it down and I'm gonna put in this pull that comes right out got a little piece on the side it's up and down I was telling you about okay see your carrots all cut up what we're gonna do is uh, put these in my food saver and this right here is a smaller one so we'll do a few with the smaller uh, attachment okay see it's in there it's not going into place so since we're done, we'll still use, I'm still going to do this. So it's going to be noisy. Of course, you know, it's, it's a mix, so it's going to be noisy. And actually, so you'll be able to see it, let me get another bowl so you can see um, 
how small the ovens are. Let me just put some of these in here. Because I make good carrot cakes and all that stuff so I can uh, freeze these carrots and use them for that. Okay, let's begin to move. shredded carrots. See how fine the shredded they are? They are finely shredded. And these right here are the ones that didn't get really fine. But I can still use these in carrot cake. It's going to cook. And there are so many attachments. Now they're kind of pricey. KitchenAid is pricey with these attachments. Um, but there are meat attachment where you can grind meat. You have pasta attachment where you can make your pasta and they got the thing that rolls the pasta out. So it's, it's, it's good. Like I said, I've had this for over a year, maybe two years, and I'm just now actually using it. Uh, so don't forget to give me thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, share, like, and thanks for watching my channel. And I, uh, hit that notification bell to turn it black, actually. That way, you'll know any other videos that um, I might be uh, uploading. And thanks for watching my channel.